Hello? Hi, Ed. Oh, hey, honey. Are you getting ready to leave? It's almost six o'clock. Oh, wow. I totally lost track of time. It's just been crazy busy here lately. They keep loading me down with more and more work. I want to leave as soon as we can. It's been weeks since we saw Alex. I know. I know. Can't wait to see him. I'll start packing up, and I'll be out of here soon, okay? All right, then. I'll let you get moving. Okay, Rita. I'll, uh, I'll see you about seven. Love you. Love you, too. Hey, Ed. Did you hear? What? They're laying off a bunch of people today. And how do you know that, Liz? It's going around the office. HR are calling people in. I've already seen a few people dazed and mad as hell. Well, you don't have anything to worry about. Why should I worry? I think I do a pretty good job around here. Mm, you've gotten into it with the boss a few times lately. He has a memory like an elephant. He doesn't forget things like that. Hmm. He doesn't like you very much. Who? The boss! Sure he does. No! He just tolerates you because you do a few things that no one else can. Liz, if he asks my opinion, I tell him what I think. I owe him that. If he wanted someone to just agree with him, he could ask you. Oh, sometimes it's not what you say, but how you say it. So I kiss a little butt sometimes. He likes that. Hey, I'm just trying to survive. I don't have time for politics. I have a lot of experience. And I'd like to think, if you were about to walk off the edge of a cliff, he'd like to be warned. I know I would. Doesn't like to be shown up, that's all. Well, enough. I have this one thing I have to finish and then get out of here. Please. Well, we should be home free. It's almost six. Any plans this weekend? Yeah, actually, Rita and I are going up to our son's school this weekend. Oh. We haven't seen him in a couple of months. Penn State Law School? No, Penn. First year. <laughs> Big bucks. <laughs> Tell me about it. But it's a real investment. Kind of a struggle for us. Mm. But he'll be great. He's very persuasive, you know. And you? Mm, the usual. Errands. May take the kids to the movies. <laughs> the oldest one's going to the dentist. Maybe time for braces. Mm. Mm. Mike? Can I just get my go? I don't know. It's not any financial problems. No. Ed, oh good, you haven't left yet. I need to see you before you leave. What about? Just stop by in a few minutes, okay? It won't take long. I'll, I'll be there soon. He wants to see me before I leave today. Why? I don't know. But I think Susan was just let go. And Dave Miller, too. Rita, I think I'm going to get fired. Ed, it's probably something else. I've been here ten 
years. No raise in nine. Where the hell am I going to find a job at my age? Just stay calm until you find out what it is, and then we'll deal with it together. Rita HR is calling again. I better go. Call me as soon as you can. I will. Good luck, honey. I love you. Love you too. Did you forget about me? Hardly. I'll be I'll be over in a minute. Sit down, Ed. Today's been a very difficult day. Business has not been great. We've had to let go of several people, some of them very valuable to this organization. Look, if with the layoffs, those of us who stay are going to have to pick up the slack. Starting Monday, you are going to have to take up some more responsibility. You mean I'm not fired? No, but those of us who still have our jobs are going to have to be putting in more time and energy to get this company moving in the right direction again. We know you have talent. We hope you have the energy. Thanks for stopping by. So, I still have my job? Yes, for now. 